and then goalie Okaf. That's what he told me, Okaf. Said, hey, I said, not Okafor, I said, no, that's the American pronunciation. <laughs> hey, you give the man what he wants. Right? The big guy. Proper pronunciation. Knock. It is always is interesting, too. It, sometimes it depends on who's doing the translating. What the name is. So here we go, Jerry Gaspard and Ngoli Okaf. That's going right at it. Big guys, 201. 63 Okaf versus 510 Gaspard. The fans always wait to see if one of these guys can drop the big one on his opponent. No matter what level, there's always the anticipation of a big power shot in the heavyweight, the super heavyweight division. Okaf has stopped two of the opponents on the way to the finals. And here might be that explosion. Okaf has gotten two. An uppercut, part. An uppercut might end this fight. Big right hand here. This one is on limited time. The standing eight referee will assess Six, the fighter. Seven, eight. Probably let it go on. Here comes Okaf. Okaf just needs to keep the distance. Boy, height and reach and power. Oh, that's kind of hard to beat. <laughs> Not to mention torque, getting full leverage into his shots. Good right hand by Okaf, and a nice uppercut. Oh, man. Oh, what an arsenal he here. Now. He is getting everything into his punches. And Gaspard just can't seem to set himself. He says on the outside he's got a problem. If he tries to exchange on the inside, he's got a problem. He's got nothing but problems with this guy. That right hand did a little damage. Stood him straight up and stopped him in his tracks. I don't think he has his legs. around for N'Goli Okaf. Beautiful, beautiful. Everything is a jab. You see what I'm talking about? Ethan Hawke on hand to see Okaf. Likes what he sees, too. Absolutely. Recover. Recover. You see how the, see how the jab is working? Now when you start hitting... Talk about big punches from a big man. The right hand, the uppercut before that, another right hand. Chopping right hand, another uppercut. Okaf just teeing off right now. Good, good compact punches for a big man, too. Yeah, he closes the distance quite well. If they weren't wearing headgear, Ooh. this bout would be over. Right? Absolutely. Hands up. Right? Okay. We're, we're, yeah, even with the headgear, some referees may have stopped it there. That, it, it came into judgment territory. Down the well, that's where the eight count helps them out. It gives them the ref that eight seconds to make the decision as well. Second round, scheduled for four or less. Jerry Gaspard and Ngoli Okaf. Okay. Okaf in the blue. Too much power on the cop side. Novice competition, three two-minute rounds. And Okaf threatening to make it less, but Gaspard He's not going to go quietly as he right comes on. Back. How about that? Nice right hand. Here he comes back at him. We've got ourselves a beauty here in round two. The cops will be shooting that jab instead of the right hand. Gaspar to the body. His confidence has come on now. Okaf mouth wide open. Does Gaspard believe that Okaf punched himself out in the last round? Will he try to do more? Well, not when he gets hit like that. Even when he's tired, Okaf not getting cheated. Oh, what action here. Give Gaspard a lot of credit. He took so much punishment earlier. He did. Oh, he walked into something. He takes 
some more now. Back and forth they go. As we come to the end of round two, this one is a treat. Gaspar and Okaf. Oh, the mouthpiece goes flying. Coming near the end of round two. And a standing eight count. And a flying mouthpiece. Is he paying attention? Explosive end of round two. Oh, he has spent it. everything. Beautiful, beautiful. Recover, Ingo. Recover. Recover. Kick your legs out. Kick, Kick your legs out. Kick your legs out. Wet them down. Wet them down. Come on. Come on. Come on. Top, right there. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Come on. Breathe. Ingo. Breathe. Breathe. How slow. Gaspar was doing pretty well earlier in the fight. Had Okaf, Okaf against the ropes and was just pounding away. Wouldn't let him get away. But later on in the fight, here comes the big man. Right hand. Really hurt him. And the mouthpiece flying. Just walked him down. Big right hand. We talked about the headgear being on, guys. If, if it wasn't there, he would have been knocked out. Yeah. We do have two tired guys. Yes, we do. Very tired. Okay. Two minutes, you hear me? If you hear me? Two minutes and go. Give me everything. Well, corner work is, is a lot of chemistry, which is the best way to motivate your fighter. The rah-rah treatment working for both guys. One trainer's cursing, the other one's slapping <laughs> his guy. <laughs> and the slapping's a good thing, okay. Yes. <laughs> Round three of beauty. Jerry Gaspard and Ngoli Okaf. Dave Bontempo, Tony Page, and Kathy Burke with you here. They both may be tired, but Okaf still has the power. This part leaning in. Oh man, <laughs> didn't expect that. Well, Tony, there's 10 seconds between big shots. These guys are done. Oh. <laughs> Either the right hand by Okaf or the uppercut might end the fight. Gaspar just needs to put punches together in bunches. Might be easier said than done. Looking at two wide open mouths, you can see their mouthpieces clearly. Okaf drilling some big shots in. A ton of heart between these two guys. You talk about wanting it. Oh. Here comes Okaf. Right, here comes Gaspar. <laughs> Big shots here by Okaf. Big heart by Gaspar. Uh, we're ready. Let's see how it all played out. The heavyweight novice champion is from the blue corner in Yoli Okafor. <laughs> Dominating performance. A little bit of emotion. Gaspard wondering. Why did I have to be facing this guy tonight? <laughs> the exhilaration and the resignation. Great bout. And we'll have more after this.